Corey, dragging a shovel, hitting things occasionally, maybe digging a few holes in the rain, you know, maybe stopping for some corn along the way. I would watch that video. Hello there maggots, Lauren here, and I don't know if it's Maggot Monday, but behold, the Slipknot Christmas tree. Today is December 6th. I know it's after Christmas. We're into January by the time you're seeing this video. But since I had my Slipknot tree up, I thought I'm going to do this music video today. And we'll just um, extend Christmas a little longer. So I'm going to do Dead Memories today. It won the latest music video poll. Here are the results. I just filmed Vendetta for All Hope Is Gone, that poll. I figured this is also a good time to do this since it's on the same album. Here we go. I just need a second. Was that Corey in the beginning? Because at first I thought, yeah, it was. And then I was like, no, it wasn't. And then I thought, well, yeah, it is. I'm going to have to go back. <laughs> I have to go back. I'm going to watch the beginning again, and I, I'll meet you back here. And then Sid's crawling on the walls. I don't know. This is very strange. Um, but yeah, I'll be right back. I have to check this out again. All right, I'm back. That was clearly Corey. I don't know what's wrong with me. Yeah, that was obviously Corey. I don't know. Corey in the rain. Okay. I'm a fan. I'm a fan of Corey in the rain. Doing manual labor. He just fell through the floor. Sid's crawling on the walls. Uh, okay, let's get back to this. Now, uh, if you're new here, let me just say, this is not for the song, it's for the video, so I'll be pausing it to talk about things. I've heard the song before. I thought they were going to start braiding Joey's hair. That'd be like a whole other kind of thing. They were, they were backcombing it though, what's with that? But, since we we're looking at Joey here, what are these branch things? I mean, are they just supposed to be like branch, branches, roots? I don't know. It's very cool looking. I've seen some pictures with that. So I think what you had said is like each person has their own little little scene, I guess. And Corey's just going to go and see each person. So, okay. <laughs> oh no. Yeah, I'm starting over. <laughs> Start not the whole thing, but I have to see this pinhead section. Why does it look like a negative? And what did he just put in the in the nail? Oh my god. 
I'm feeling really stupid today. Like I've never seen videos before. Like, what is this moving picture? Just Pinhead. It looks like he looks like he kind of looks like Pigpen or uh, whenever Linus was scared in the pumpkin patch and it, all of his hair. Let's go. What that is? What is that? <laughs> oh my god. I'm having trouble with this video. Um, the thing with Paul in the mirror, seeing that now is very like symbolic or something that like Corey, it's almost like his reflection is Paul, like he sees himself. So that, that whole scene is just kind of like, takes on a whole new meaning now than when it was shot. That's my favorite part. That whole that whole thing. Like even without Paul being gone now. Just the whole look of that and the, the symbolism there, which they it wasn't even symbolic at the time. It was symbolic for other reasons. But you know what I mean? That's just like a whole other I don't know what. We got some girls now. Are these Joey's girls or this guy has his own girls? Who who has the girls? Oh, of course. <laughs> Of course, he directed the video, right? He's like, I'm gonna get the... I'm gonna these ladies. <laughs> Go back. Go back. Okay, for one thing, it takes a special kind of man to, you know, you have these these girls with hardly any clothes on, like, grabbing at you, saying, stay here with us, and yet Corey's like, nope, I gotta go, I gotta go, but then he walks into this hallway and sees that, <laughs> scariest man ever, I think he just, I'd go back, Corey, just, just go back, <laughs> oh my god, now obviously, I'm sure you knew this was coming, I have to see The Undertaker again. Oh my god. He's always... I mean, you know that you're a scary individual when all you have to do is stand there and you are such a frightening presence. And then he crosses his arms and his intimidation just goes up a whole level. <laughs> Probably like, oh god, who is this?
I was just about to say, why does the Pinocchio get any girls? And then one showed up. Oh, that's the end. That's the end. These squares in here I can't see. But, uh, Corey's digging. Was the person over there, Corey? I can't, there's a square there. I don't know who was over there. Um, okay. Here's the thing with this video. I don't know what I was expecting the video to be like. I think the idea is cool that like each guy has their own little scene and, and Corey is just going from room to room. I'm sure it is symbolic in ways that I just don't understand right now. I don't know about, you know, all the girls and the the feathers and the, eh. That just seems like, you know, another kind of video, like another genre of video that I'm glad these guys don't really do, except they did today. But eh, Pinhead, I'm just, it's just funny that Pinhead is like, I don't want anyone to be in my room. I'm going to be alone. I don't even want Corey in here. But I guess, I guess Corey can come in. But I don't want anybody else in here. And Sid didn't have anybody either. I'm surprised that he didn't have all the girls with him. I mean, if Clown Guy directed the video, then it makes a lot of sense. Like, I'm going to have all these girls with me. Uh, all these scantily clad ladies. Enjoying a little clown action. But he's, he's just swinging his bat around. Nobody brings him in like a swinging bat, let me tell you. But let me see this again, and I will be right back. Hello, I'm back. I watched the video again. And as always, when you watch something or listen to something again, you get more out of it. Still, though, I have to say, not one of my favorite videos. But the section with Paul is by far the best. And I think even... Without it being so symbolic now, I think it would still be my favorite part just because of the whole look of it was very cool. How it was shot and the colors and everything. That's definitely my favorite scene. And then, you know, of course, Corey digging in the rain. I could have watched Corey walking around Iowa with a shovel as the whole video. That would be an awesome video to me. Just Corey dragging a shovel hitting things occasionally, maybe digging a few holes in the rain, you know, maybe stopping for some corn along the way. I would watch that video, but as it is, I liked it. It just wasn't one of my favorite ones. That will do it for this video. Thank you so much for watching and voting in the polls. Have an awesome rest of your day and I'll see you for the next one.